Hello and welcome to Kitchen Counter and Crafts. If you like this video, would you please like, comment, share, and subscribe. And if you'd like some more pen reviews or ink reviews, would you please hit the bell icon and that way you'll be alerted to new ones. For today's video, I am going to review the Pelican, 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 however you wanna say it, I'm gonna say Pelican because it's got the bird on it. Um, M205 Duo Neon, and this is not an unboxing, although I wanted to have the box here because it's pretty cool, uh, but here is the information on the end of the box, and it says M205 Duo Highlighter BB Neon Gel B, and so you are going to see um, a neon pen and also the neon ink that goes with it, so it's a really neat looking box. Uh, so that's why I wanted to share that part with it, but it shows that you can not only write with the pen, but also highlight. So it's got some really kind of beautiful imagery, I guess, on the box. But here's where it, I think it looks even cooler and um, is really eye-catching on this kind of greenish, yellow type of a color of not just the pen but also the highlighter ink so and then it says perfect on there and i i just love this color i think it's super cool and uh this pen has already been inked but like i said i just wanted to show you how neat the box is because you know it like it or not it's kind of about the packaging as well so Anyway, here is the pen and the ink, and I'm going to do a separate ink review so that you have a chance to see the highlighter in action, but today I'm gonna to just do a little bit of writing with the pen so that you get a, a good idea, but hang on for another video. I'll try to post it in the next day or so, and it will have a review of the ink. So this is the Pelican or Pelican pen. Okay, I'm gonna just pick one, I guess, to say. And it has chrome finish. It's got the clip here that is supposed to look like the Pelican uh, bill. So it's, I think it's, that part's kind of cool. And then it has a chrome uh, band here. This is actually a reissue of a pen that, the highlighter pen that came out in 2010. That was a special edition, and the reason why it's called a duo is so that you have a fountain pen and a highlighter, therefore the dual mechanism of the pen, if you will. So you can write with this and also highlight with it, and um, I think that's kind of nice to know where the names come from. So on the end of the finial, you've got the pelican bird, and then uh, down here is the, the mechanism, the plunger mechanism that you can actually see through this very neat looking pen body. So it's actually one of those, I think an eye-catching pen. If you were to pull that out of your pocket, people might not notice what it is, but I have to say there's something very different about a fountain pen that's a highlighter. And I actually did not understand that, uh, but it is meant again, to be used as a fountain pen so that you can put your little notes into the column and then also have the highlighting ink that you can um, really highlight and play with. So this used to be a special edition, by the way, on the nib, it's a BB nib. So BB is like double broad and uh, you have a pelican insignia, the, the bird also on there. Don't know if you can tell very well. There it is. And then the feed underneath, just a plastic feed it looks like. And then uh, the body, which is again, very cool looking, I think. So this um, came out in 2010, as I mentioned, and then has um, the Pelican also came out with a green version in 2013. And this is, the ink is supposed to be like a yellow, big type of a fluorescent neon ink. And, uh, but I, I don't know if you can tell, again, I'm gonna do this in the daytime so you can kind of see that this ink is more of like a greenish yellow. So I'm gonna put, do a, a sample for you here. Pelican. 
Nikon M205 in the BB nib. Uh, it's gonna be hard to see what I'm writing. I'm gonna pull this up uh, after I'm done. And the ink is the highlighter ink. I know you can't write with this through the camera, but I'm gonna just tell you, it's actually a very, very, very smooth writer. The ink is very wet in case you can tell. And by the way, this is just the uh, cheap ledger pad. If you, I, I think most people have cheap copy paper. Uh, you can really have that. So I'm gonna just see how much it seeps through. And a writing sample for you. You have to admit, that is such an amazing ink color. So the best part of this is that, you know, a lot of times with highlighters, you're not going to be able to write with those, you're just there highlighting off of um, whatever you have. But with this BB nib, you're actually able to not only write, but also see what you're writing. So you really do have um, the dual nature of the pen. You can also fill this up with other inks if you just want a double broad pen. So it's actually a really nice system for this. Um, so there's the, the highlight ink. Let me cap this before it dries out. So my friend has this um, this flashlight that is a black light, and so she she just gave me this to play with. Which check that out. So you've got the the black light, and it's just fluorescing like crazy on this paper. And I just think, I mean, I know you're not gonna walk around with a black light flashlight but come on that's that's super cool you gotta admit and you can tell where i i got some on my my fingers as well so you know if you're just kind of hiding out um at night some night and um you want to fluoresce your ink i just think that's you got you gotta say that's pretty darn cool so anyway um the cap is a screw on cap let me see how many turns it takes so one oh one one turn and then uh, from what I understand, there's different nibs available from like Nibsmith and some other places. But really the, the reason for this is to have a highlighter nib so that you can not, you, you don't have to kind of go back and forth on um, other stuff that you've written on. So this is the other thing that I test on. It's my Rhodia dot pad paper. So I've got my other writing samples here. Let me put it on better paper for you. Again, I just kind of like to see how it does on uh, horrible paper. Mm, let me also show you, there's no bleed through at all, even on the, the cheap stuff. So here we have, again, the, There's a little bit of feedback, but it's more like a squeaky. I don't know if you can hear that. Kind of sounds like a marker, but. Very, very smooth writer. Very wet. Of course, that's to be expected with the big nib as well. And then let me just do a quick writing. So it, even with my quick writing, it really performs well. And you can even see 
the fluorescing on this better paper. Um, it, there's a comparison between the cheap stuff and the the nice stuff. So you can, I mean, it's it's doing pretty well on on both. I have to say. So anyway, uh, is it good to shell out a little bit over a hundred something bucks for this? That's going to be up to you. I personally think that you're getting the Pelican nib writing. Uh, it's a beautiful experience, very smooth writer. You also have a BB nib, which is an extra wide. So I love uh, doing some art and calligraphy. This is not a calligraphy nib, but I think for art, it would be a really nice nib to use. It's definitely great for highlighting. And again, like I said, I'll do a, a video on the ink itself and see how it compares to maybe some light colored inks that you could actually use for highlighting. The highlighting ink though is special for this. It does come in that gift box, but now I do understand that not only the yellow, but also the green is available to purchase. So you could maybe try it out in a different pen, but then you really lose this cool highlighter with the matchy matchy ink. And you know how great it is to be matchy matchy, especially with your pens and inks, cause that's kind of a thing. So anyway, I hope you enjoyed that review on the Pelican M205 Duo highlighter pen with the BB nib. And if you have any comments or if you've used this or if you love it or if you hate it, why don't you let me know about it? And until the next time, bye.